Right, hey guys, how are we doing? Back with another video from Six, and today we're checking out Sage Naruto versus the Sani. Now, I don't know if Naruto could actually do this. Now, bear with me, I'm not the scaler, but I just feel like Jiraiya had a pretty hard time against Pain, and Naruto didn't do much better. Um, and then you throw Tsunade in the mix. If she just gets one punch or one punch on Naruto, he's done. And Orochimaru's got all sorts of stuff going on. Like, did you see? Like, <laughs> how um <laughs> what Itachi had to use the uh, the Tusk blade and all that on him and uh, all the data books say about that snake form that he had that he used that was like the most strongest like form he had um, I don't know if all three Sani went all out on Naruto in Sage mode I feel like maybe they would win but <laughs> let me know how wrong I am in the comments section and let's see what they say oh this features Sakage as well which is cool. Uh, yeah, just, I have to remember how powerful Sage Naruto is. Yeah. And there's a specific group of people who I think that when you put people up against them, it's a lot more interesting than the one people like to put everybody up against, which is the Akashi. Kasuke, yeah, it's always and that, right? I think the Sani versus Sage Naruto is um, a much more interesting matchup than Sage Naruto versus yes. Kasuki, whatever it be, even though you know you already fought pain and lost. Um, anyway, Swag said... <laughs> Uh, <laughs> yeah, my bad. I was trying to keep the reveal a surprise, but I couldn't not. Hey, hey. I mean, the title <laughs> gives it away as well. But... I mean, anyway. No. Sage <laughs> Naruto versus the Sani. When I first like came to it with Swag, I had the idea that, okay, this is pretty straightforward. Easy video. No. Sage Naruto just slaps and grabs it. No. By the way, we're talking about pain art from Sage Naruto. Yeah, 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 yeah. I forget that, yeah. Or at least not here at the beginning. We might go over yeah. that later. But then we started talking about it, and the, the battle is just far more complicated than I could ever have imagined. Oh, wow, okay. Um, so one thing I wasn't considering when I first looked at it, there's a, there's a statement in the second data book that just says whenever the signing fights together, their skills get increased by three times over. Oh. And that's already just insane because then well. at that point it's kind of hard. <laughs> wow. Straight away. Like, wait to a minute. Because you know, they fight individually and whatnot. But I mean, I guess talking about them fighting individually first and then, you know, just adding them as Grouping a Grouping them like together yeah, afterwards? It, it's definitely an easier approach, right? Because yeah. uh, I think everybody will um, be able to engage with the question of could Naruto beat them at the same time a lot more easily if uh, they know where we stand on how he would do against them. Individually, yeah. And also, if they uh, know how uh, he stacks up against them individually. Now, um, we talked about this a fair bit before the video. Um, we are going to try to keep this analysis as uh, fair as possible, right? Because even though we have our own interpretations and, you know, like opinions yeah. uh, about the stuff that's in the manga and the data books, whatever, we both recognize that there are plenty of different ways that you can interpret yeah, these approach things. these things and, uh, yeah. so we'll just lay out all the information and like we'll say what we think you guys are free to interpret it however you want and uh, depending on what you think about some of the pieces of information I guess that'll inform how you think Naruto performs here having said all that moving past that first disclaimer Jiraiya is just ass um, <laughs> whoa <laughs> like, he just doesn't I mean, by himself, no. Can, uh, okay. Yeah, because Jirai didn't even uh, master it perfectly, did he? Uh, like, there's no way you can present the information that makes Jiraiya seem stronger than Naruto. And I think, like, th th there's, like, some obscure stuff, too, that I hadn't even thought about that Six showed me here that, mm. like, makes it even more blatant. Yeah. The more you compare the two of them, the more obvious I think it becomes that Sage and Naruto is, like, Way stronger. Like, yeah, he's ma he's got Sage Mode under control without the help of Toad. Hard on that statement that Pain makes where he says that oh, if he if he knew the secret, we just we probably couldn't have won. Which you can interpret that statement multiple ways. Um, first of which being that well, if Jiraiya knew the secret of Pain to begin with, then maybe he would have just left <laughs> and told everyone. <laughs> or yeah. Something yeah. Like that. yeah. Nagato, you know, yeah. without the path of pain, uh, or pain could have 
been like, oh, well, I couldn't use my full power because I don't want to damage the rain village. Like, a million Yeah, that's, okay, yeah, there's ways you can interpret it. So the right. way I think about it, I think what Peyton is talking about is the fact that he had three extra bodies aside from the ones he had already sent to fight Jiraiya, so that if the other bodies were there, obviously they would have got a call in Frog Song too, and then mm. all the pains would have been defeated. Yeah, but that's maybe. Jiraiya with Frog Song. Obviously, Sage Naruto is going to have a counter of his own Frog Song because him and uh, he has Mon Paul. But yeah, so like, this is this is some weird about it. Like they would just both have Law and Paul in the fight. Yeah. Like it, it, right. it's, it's like you know when you pick like uh, Itachi and then pick like EMS Sasuke in Stormfort. Like the fight can't happen because it's like you know both sets of Sharingan can't exist. It's just, it's just yeah, hypothetical. It's so they both have Law yeah. and Naruto would be able to cancel Frog Song if Jiraiya tried to cast it. Also, I think Naruto is just so much faster. And stronger than Jiraiya, that Jiraiya wouldn't even get to use it. Yeah, yeah, and we can we can get to the scaling on that in a minute. But another thing too with Frog Song is that Naruto has Ma and Pa who are more willing to do the jutsu than Jiraiya's Ma and Pa are. Because when the idea mm-hmm. first gets sprung up, Ma's like, "No, I don't want to sing. I don't want to do that. I don't want to do that." But then they were planning to do it against Pain the second time. The second, so they, yeah. They're just more willing to. Hmm. Wait. Um, so the frog song I mean, it, it, it's a thing. No. So. Yeah, well, I mean, uh, another thing too. Just since this only got brought up because of the pain statement. Um. However, you want to interpret it, it cannot possibly mean that pain. All six paths together are weaker than Sage Dragon. It, it, yes. There's just no way. No. They, 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 like, like I said. I uh, am not trying to uh, say that, like, you know, my own opinion of uh, what the text says, uh, you know, supersedes it's any other this, opinion. Yeah. But, like, I, like, I legit can't, like, I, I, I've yet to see a compelling argument for it. And yeah. I've been, you know, like, looking at um, Naruto shit for, like, six years now. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> like, <laughs> <laughs> and I mean, I've, I've really looked, right? Because I've really looked like, yo, you got to research to do these kind of things. Naruto does better against pain. His sage mode is more advanced. Um, like, like, okay, so let's like let's take one direct comparison, right? So, granted, Don't Jiraiya is off guard oh. when this happens, <laughs> yeah. but uh, Jiraiya gets his arm just ripped off by the Asura pain, right? Just like one attack, he's missing an arm after. Yeah. Yeah. Then Whether the it was a sting, punch or an explosion doesn't matter. His arm was ripped. Yeah. Then later, Naruto sees the same uh, path of pain start charging at Tsunade and just blows it up with one punch. Just blitzes it. Right. Okay. Uh, so like, you know. Uh, but I think a much better comparison because again, you can't fall back on. Oh well, Jiraiya was just off guard there. That doesn't count. Um, which I, okay, that, I mean, he was. Kind of, that might even be a defeater. That yeah, works in Sage Naruto's favor, though. I'll let you finish, but I'll explain how that just kind of works yeah. in Naruto's favor. But a much better uh, point of comparison is the Prey to Path, which uh, Six just pointed this out to me before the video. But if you look very closely mm-hmm. when Jiraiya first uh, uses the massive Rasengan against the Prey to Path, he doesn't immediately start absorbing it and actually catches the massive yeah, Rasengan. Oh, yeah, yeah, he touches so it first. just like tanking it at first. And then Naruto beats the Prey to Path with one punch. Yes. Literally, right, okay, yeah, that's, that's decent. Now, didn't he need to get revived by Naraka yes. after yeah. that punch? Yeah. So, yeah, he literally had to get, like, re... Like, yeah, he had to get rejuvenated by the Naraka Path. He was basically killed. Um, and, like, the, the, the Frog Kata is literally just, like, it takes your normal Taijutsu and, like, extends the ring, right? Yeah. Meanwhile, we're talking about uh, Jiraiya's massive Rasengan. Maximum yeah, he actually touches it first before absorbing it. Yeah. His absolute strongest attack, and the Prey to Path not only tanked it, but then absorbed it, and Naruto just one shot it. Now, yeah. aside from yeah. that, when Fair. Was Fair. 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 was off guard, if Imperfect, if Jiraiya's in Sage Mode, keep that in mind, if that means Imperfect Sage Mode does not have the Danger Sensory that normal Sage Mode provides users because he 
punch Sage or, or Sage dry his arm off. So that actually just works in Sage Naruto's favor. And then on top of that, you have you know the 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 Master Rasengan thing, the fact that it's just part of the. That game. is so crazy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the, the Master Rasengan one is really the slam dunk. Like, I mean, he just yeah. takes it. Yeah. It, it, I mean, it, it's so blatant too. Like seriously, um, I was gonna say go look. The page will probably be up on the screen. Yeah, but like, like just look at the page right now. Yeah. Like you can, like there's really clear like you can see like the indentations or like the lines or whatever where he's like catching it, you know, and it's like the foom sound effect, like it's hitting him, not like it's like like getting absorbed. <laughs> Oh, Swakari is full of this. Oh, he's, there is actually a Swakari video I'm going to be reacting to this book that I haven't done yet. I will take that, yeah. yeah I don't want to say it at the start, but I'm just trying to be funny. <laughs> says it himself and right then okay. Naruto just like overpowers Boom. all yeah. like blatantly okay. like he beats the animal path summons and then beats the animal path he one shots the uh Prada path and the human path gets like no just by a Ross and Shirt. yeah yeah, yeah. And, and then on top of that Jirai is fighting weak pads he's fighting yeah, yeah he's the, the, the animal yeah, that's human yeah <laughs> Yeah, like, like again, like Naruto fights all three of those paths of pain with other paths of pain. Oh, don't get me wrong, what I said at the start. I don't think Orochimaru had like any chance against Itachi, even if he didn't use the um, Tosuke Blade. I'm just saying, like, you know, the form that Orochimaru could actually like go into is pretty damn powerful. I just realized what I could have potentially put out there. I, know, I don't think Orochimaru could have beat Itachi at all. <laughs> Jiraiya yeah, being one. Well. <laughs> now, if you really, really, truly believe that Six and I are missing something with that, like, pain statement, I mean, alright, man, sure. If you no, Naruto that, does a like, much better job fighting pain than Jiraiya did. Like, he didn't beat him, I like Jiraiya, but, yeah. I guess more power to But, <laughs> as far as I can tell, literally every Sage Naruto being stronger than Jiraiya. Yeah. And that's not even getting into how, like, in a fight, Naruto just has easier access to Sage Mode than Jiraiya, who takes, like, a bajillion years to enter it. But, you know, like, well, yeah, it doesn't even really help accessing it, right? the like, form. Just say they both start in Sage Mode. Yeah. And Naruto still uh, has an overwhelming advantage. And I hope people don't think that, like, base Jiraiya would be. <laughs> <laughs> She gets a punch in. Tsunade, she gets uh, now this is going to make people mad. Uh, people never like hearing this. Um, but Jiraiya is the weakest of the Sun. Uh, Ooh. Um, Ooh. 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 And, wow. Um, the reason I say that is because, well, I mean, most people agree that, like, it's fair. And 
I'm not mad. I'm not mad. people agree that it's at least fair to consider Orochimaru the strongest sign. Yeah, like, I would say that. People look at you weird if you say that. No, I... just be like, oh, you know, well, I get what you say that, but I disagree. I think it's dry. Right? I can see but, that. like, a lot of people don't seem to think that, like, dry is weaker than Tsunade. Most people seem to think that she's the weakest. But the thing is, um, Jiraiya did not fight Madara. Mm -hmm. Never. Uh, did not fight anyone close <laughs> Here we go. Here we go. And, yeah. like, like, she did. Tsunade does a really good job. She does well. Yeah, she stands like, around. Nice right? job. Yeah, I, I was about to say, she is the only one who's, like, actually, like, damaging him. Like, significantly, I should say. She punches through um, as well. She, she cracks through his Susano as well. His wood clone. Yeah. Okay. Um, she, like, breaks open. The Susano. Yeah. She tanks hits from his Susano. Yeah. Like, keeps fighting him. This Susano blade is like stuck. It's like it's like she's impaled by it, and she doesn't care. Just keeps she keeps going. Him. And you know, Dry is getting his whole like body mutilated by punches from the Serpent. <laughs> so like, oh <laughs> no. Tsunade, maybe you could say like she got stronger in the war arc. Like, I, mean, I don't know. I think that so I had a different outlook on this before, but Six told me. Uh, that I was probably wrong about this, and I think I agree with him now, but I thought that Tsunade would have actually been stronger in the pain arc because she would have had more chakra in her Byakugo huh. than in the yeah. war okay. arc. Yeah. But it, it, like Six told me that the Byakugo just has like a set max chakra and then it activates, and I think I actually agree with that okay. now. Yeah. But I mean, like, I, I don't think that it's like unreasonable for anybody to think that, but what I will say is there's no actual like evidence that she got stronger. Yeah, and I can see what Six is saying. It's like it just it has a point where it just stops, and it's like okay, and it just stays there. Of the work, um, so she didn't really have time to train, and I'm pretty sure like immediately after she woke up, she just got to like planning, and you know doing a bunch of like uh desk work and like tactical work for the Allied Shinobi forces uh, to make sure that everything was in order. I don't after she started eating or whatnot. Yeah, you could see it. Yeah, your chakra. I remember. Yeah. Yeah, so she didn't have time to, like, train and stuff, right? So right. maybe she was stronger when she fought Madara, but it would be marginally at best. Yeah, um, okay. Nick thinks that she had, like, a mental amp or something, and I don't think yeah. that I agree with it, but if you think that she... Well, here, I'll let you explain that before I keep going. So there's basically this thing called the Will of Fire. Here's an explains yeah. it in part one. It is something that all comes That's a movie. Have. It's just that <laughs> in the middle of a desperate battle, you're going to become as strong as you Need are. Need to be. Somebody just mentions that her true power lies in the will of fire, and then that's when she starts attacking Madara, um, doing noticeably a lot better. She feels like she's protecting also the village. The first time in, in the, the manga, at least, that we see that she uses the 100 healings in combat to actually amp herself or whatever she's doing. Now, there is, uh, I think it's a novel. Uh, I'm not saying the novels are canon, by the way, just saying, just mentioning. This is out there okay. that says that when Tsunade is punching, she's actually breaking her bones, but the hundred healing is just it's healing it fast. Yeah. It really doesn't matter. But yeah, I basically That's just think Tsunade was mental amps through that. Um, but I don't know, maybe she would, you, you could even argue maybe she would get the same type of mental amp in this fight, considering she has other teammates to protect, just like yeah. she was against the five Kage. But well, I, I just thought thing. we wanted to mention it. Another thing, too, is that you could also maybe argue that Jiraiya would have gotten a Will of Fire amp against Pain, too. Quite so, probably, yeah. You know, yeah. Um, yeah. That maybe that's what came through when he killed the animal pack. You know, maybe. Because he was trying to make sure everybody at least had the intel they needed not to get completely wiped out by Pain. So, like... Did that book I just say that Jiraiya, like, hardened his resolve on that first kick? When you remember he yeah. the human pad and knocked out his eyes? It does say hard in his resolve for that. Um, so, so, I I don't think it's, like, bulletproof that, like, I, I think that, like, I get what Six is saying. Um, maybe you agree with it. I don't know. I don't think it's necessarily a defeater for uh, the idea that Tsunade is stronger than Jiraiya. But I think that what we can all agree, uh, regardless of how you interpret that statement, is that these are better feats than Jiraiya has. Like, 
quite a mile. So like Jiraiya can yeah. compared to this. Oh yeah, goal. definitely, like, definitely, definitely, yeah. definitely stacks up higher than Jiraiya. The greater path, like tanking the Mazda Singa, is the same thing Madara and Susana would do. And Tsunade just kicked it. Yeah. So. Tsunade is stronger than Jiraiya. And if we use these as like the basis... Yeah, if she gets Tsunade, a punch, I'll just do um, punch like Naruto. <laughs> Yeah, definitely. It's a different story. Yeah, yeah. And I, I think that this is a little bit weird, too, because it's like, I don't know if it's fair to use these war arc Oh, for like Tsunade. talking about pain arc Naruto, but like I yeah, said earlier, right. it doesn't seem like Tsunade Much of a power boost difference, between yeah. the pain arc and now. So I don't know where to draw, like, the cutoff point, but I think that Tsunade actually... No, okay, look, I'm going to get in trouble for this. Okay. Uh, don't get mad at Six, because he's not the one saying But, in the Madara fight, at that point, Tsunade definitely was the strongest member of the song. Like, based on these. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I, agree. I can give you that. Oh, okay. Cool. Okay. All right. <laughs> I, yeah. So, my, my issue with the, this Tsunade thing kind of comes in whenever we start talking about speed. Because... Yeah. Okay. Say Naruto is faster than her, even in the... Yeah, yeah, but if she hits him, <laughs> she hits him. <laughs> that's that's really that's really all I care about. Because if Sage Naruto's faster than her, and then on top of that he's got like the precognition or whatever, then I think that's enough. Because I mean, all he has to do is get out of the way of Tsunade. Like, yes, yeah. I think that that's definitely a fair way yeah. to approach the fight. Um, and so what I will say is that I think if Naruto gets hit by he's one done. of these like Susano shattering punches. He's probably dead. Yeah, he's dead. Um, yeah. yeah. But, like, I think that there's a strong case to be made that he just wouldn't get hit by... Uh, yeah, it's all good, isn't it? Um, now, scaling him to the rest of the series is, like, weird, because Pain's only real opponents um, are, like, like, people who just get way stronger in the coming arcs. So it's hard to scale Sage Naruto here to, like, the Raikage... Mm. Or like Onoki or whatever. Um, but one way you can do it is, um, and now, now I don't necessarily agree with this, but Obito okay. seems to think that Sage Naruto is stronger than Sasuke at the very beginning of the Kage Summit, mm -hmm. like before the Kage Summit starts and before any of the fights begin. Yeah, however, stronger than the one who said be on fire or whatever. Yeah. However. I think that Sasuke does get stronger over the course of uh, the Kage Summit. Oh yeah, look at the opponents he fights, Jesus like, Christ. <laughs> like, okay, so, 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 yeah, yeah, like his Susano is developing, you know, yeah. the card is saying like his hatred is getting stronger, and so yeah. it's like, you know, Chakra is getting more intense and stuff like that. Now, the thing is, the Raikage fight happens at the beginning, so I don't know how much stronger he got between when he tagged the Raikage with his Chidori, and when Obito said that about him. Yeah. But if Naruto was still stronger than Sasuke uh, when, you know, he tagged the Raikage with his Chidori, then Naruto should be around as fast as the Raikage. In right, yeah, 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 I see what you're saying. And yeah, that would make him faster. Tsunade can't keep up. Uh, obviously. Now, the thing is, like, I don't know, because, it's like, Naruto seems to only surpass the Raikage when he gets KCM. Yeah, the Kyuubi 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 so he probably is he's definitely not faster than the Raikage's full speed. Maybe his like comfortable like V one like suppressed combat speed that he's using at the beginning of the fight with Sasuke, but not like full power Raikage. So so it's important to to mention this as well. When you talk about the Raikage and his lightning cloak, when you say V one and V two, those are fan terms, right? Like me and Swag yeah. use them to you know, just so you know which version we're talking about. Yeah. Like, there is no V1, V2. It's the V1 we refer to, quote unquote, is just the Raikage holding back the lightning cloak to some unknown extent. And then there's a threshold where his chakra or his hair just spikes up. Goes yeah. super saiyan and then, and then goes zoom. V1, V2. So when, when Naruto, Casey when Naruto is struggling to get past the Raikage, there's a, a few interpretations of this. Um, there, there's mainly the one people like to go with uh, nowadays is the fact that Naruto just actually got stronger while going up against the Raikage or got faster and was able to get past him. Um, I know a lot of people used to think Naruto was just holding back uh, and then there was another argument that Naruto was mental him, but it kind of it doesn't make sense to the narrative.
would be like really weird. Yeah, it would be redundant. The Rikage wouldn't let him go. It's just like that would be bad story writing in general. So Naruto probably just got stronger there. Um, and obviously the whole thing surrounding Casey and Moin, kind of the whole time he has it, is its speed. Like Tsunade is surprised that Naruto, Casey and Naruto can even keep up with, with, with Rikage. With Rikage yeah. with. And then it was obviously, you know, when he speed blitz Kisame, they were like, oh, is he? Like no, he's just. Um, yeah. Casey Wentz basically just focused on speed. So I think it would be weird if Pain Arc Naruto was faster than Casey and Wen Naruto. So I don't really think he skills to the right Kage, but it doesn't really matter too much to the whole, like, Sani tier people. The Sani are just, you know, they, they might be stronger than the right Kage, they shouldn't be faster. That's all. Yeah, they, yeah, I agree with that. I, um, there is this, like, myth. That's uh, been perpetuated throughout the community that like it works like Dragon Ball, where like speed and power go up uh, concurrently in Naruto. And not for not everybody. There are people who have like higher stat bars in one stat. Than yeah, them. not everything um, goes up for like everybody. Like right? the Raikage is a speedster. I think that's his whole thing. Mm -hmm. uh, so him being faster than Tsunade isn't a big deal. I think that the most direct form of scaling for Naruto uh, to Tsunade, but it's weird because she's out of chakra here, I, it's more of a narrative argument, is that uh, when the Asura path like, lunges at Tsunade, Naruto blitzes it, like, no difficulty. But Tsunade's out of chakra, so I think, like, like in a debate setting, if you were trying to scale Naruto over Tsunade, it would be really hard to use this, but I think that Kishimoto is clearly trying to convey uh, with this scene that Naruto has surpassed uh, Tsunade and like the Sani and is able to like protect them uh, the same way they would have protected him back in part one. Right? Right, right. I think that's yeah. the whole like narrative goal here. So this is a weird roundabout way to argue that Naruto would be faster than Tsunade, but he probably is. I mean, yeah, he probably is. Yeah, I mean, definitely probably is. Yeah, so if she gets a hit in, he's out. So I think the fight's a lot more interesting than Naruto versus Jiraiya, yeah, definitely, but I would definitely. probably give it to Naruto. Yeah, like a Ross and Shuriken that's just taking Sonata down. Yeah. Um, yeah so to, to start talking about Orochimaru, we're not talking about Orochimaru from part one, because Orochimaru from part one should be weaker than Sage Jiraiya. Um, at least that's what I think. Because Data Book 1 directly compares Base Jiraiya and Orochimaru to one another. Just says they're on par with one another. And then... Yeah, the, the most charitable you can be to Orochimaru there is to say that he's equal to Sage Jiraiya. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah either way, like, he, we, we're not using R1 Orochimaru, but the yeah. best you can get him is to say that he is equal to or relative to whatever uh, Sage Mode Jiraiya, which obviously... Doesn't help out too much in this fight, considering how we said Yeah, we said about Jiraiya already at the start. Like, mm. Yeah, so we're going to be using War Orochimaru. Now, excluding the Edo Tensei Hokage. Right? Yeah, that, that's just not back. fair. Not fair at all. Um, but he does now have Hashirama cells. He can use his eight-headed serpent jutsu. I mean, he can use that early, but still. He has eight-headed serpent jutsu. And the eight-headed serpent jutsu... Let's just say, like, base or tomorrow is, like, say, dry level, right? Okay. The eight-headed serpent jutsu... Actually, no, I kind of think Orochimaru and base is Sage dry level. Because, remember when they're fighting nerfed in the three-way deadlock, and Orochimaru 
Yeah, it's just that I got this. Basil Jamar might be that Sage Dry level. It really just depends on if you think Data Book 1 can include Sage Mode, even though it only includes information from up to Chapter 119. Mm. I don't know, maybe like some foreshadowing or whatever, because Dry is called the Toad Sage just upon introduction. Right, so I don't know, maybe it was always an idea of Kishimoto's, but Orochimaru then has the Hydra. And the Hydra just surpasses him itself. It's just stated it surpasses him. Um, uh, the, the, the most common counter to that would just be that Orochimaru gains a lot more mass whenever he enters the Hydra form, so maybe it's slower. I don't think that makes sense because, I mean, he gets all of this power, but then... What, well, just to not be able to just use it, yeah. The people he did before. Yeah, and like, he was just not sense. using it. Like, like, I know that I said earlier that power and speed don't always correlate in Naruto, but I th that's not necessarily the argument that Six is making here. He's just saying that it wouldn't be, like, practical to use the Jutsu if it made him significantly slow. Yeah, like, why would you? Yeah. Why yeah, would you? Especially, like, a genius like Orochimaru. Mm. Just yeah, he's very clever. Speed. Like, why would he do that? Yeah. Um, so then you can maybe mm. say that the Hydra surpasses Sage Jiraiya, but then we kind of get into weird territory, right, where it's like... If the Hydra surpasses Sejiraiya, how do we scale it to Naruto? Mm. Yeah, like, because Naruto also surpasses Sejiraiya. Right. <laughs> so, the, the thing about the Hydra is it might not still surpass Orochimaru in the war arc, because it's a different entity than him. Like, that's how the data book talks about it. At least in my opinion, it's a separate entity from him. Because, like, uh, I, like, it couldn't surpass him if it was him. Yeah. So it has to be a different entity, and in the war arc, he might just be stronger than it. Like when he absorbs all like Kabuto stuff and gets the Hashirama cells. Mm -hmm. Um, but like, if we assume that this is just like, uh, like Itachi pursue Orochimaru and he whips out the Hydra against Naruto, yeah, it's like impossible to scale this. Because, yeah, like, difficult. It's not like the Hydra has any anti feats aside from not being able to crack the Yada mirror with like. <laughs> 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 no, yeah. You know, that's nothing, and then like it gets one shot by the Totsuka Blade, like he's literally up against infinite attack and defense stats, so... Yeah, the strongest yeah, possible. Like, uh, <laughs> not any other people could do much against anyway, that. Anyway, um, it's impossible to scale him using this, so he could maybe be like vaguely similar to, but I don't know, I feel like if he was strong enough to like go after pain or like fight somebody who was able to fight pain, he like he would have just done it even yeah. when he was sick, you know? Like I I don't know why he would just, you know, hold this jutsu and never use it. It's like, oh man, I need to go steal a body. Well I mean he's not, right? He lost Itachi. He lost a week in Itachi. And Itachi's yeah. not as strong as pain. Yeah, exactly. So Yeah, so I mean I don't know, maybe you could do something like that to say because like Naruto, Naruto also lost to pain, but like yes. I feel like <laughs> this is weird. Serpent, or I, I feel like weakened Itachi is not getting through as many pads as Naruto did. He's definitely not, bro. Like, yeah, there, there's just no way. Um, but yeah, I mean that's that's how Naruto handles them individually. Right. But, well, so the thing is, we have to go back to War Arc Orochimaru because Warak Orochimaru, like we said, might be stronger than this serpent. And actually mm. probably should be stronger than Naruto, just because, like, I think it's, like, since he, like, absorbs all of Sage Kabuto's power, he should just be as strong oh, as Sage Kabuto, and that's yeah. stronger. Oh, yeah. So, like, he should probably be stronger than Pain Arc Sage Naruto, but then, like, if we bring out War Arc Sage Naruto, it's a completely different, different again. This guy is, like, uh, just stopping Madara's, like, wood jutsu. Uh, you know, fighting Karama and like beating Karama uh, on top of that. Um, you know, I don't agree with this feat, but he does damage and tails Obito. Obito's like massively mega ultra off guard and like tries to use Kamui but realizes he can't. So, mm, I don't know. Uh, you can interpret that feat however you want, but. War Arc uh, Sage Mode Naruto should be strong enough to fight Orochimaru without that Otensei summons. 
Yeah. Orochimaru is just a weird character to include here. Because He's just a weird character in general. <laughs> Teamwork guys, let me see. Yeah. Yeah. The Koski when working together, like all you know, the whole teamwork, the yeah. Mm-hmm. The signing are like the embodiment of the team. Yeah, they the all get three times more skilled, maybe not stronger. The, their skills increase thrice fold. Is what when all three of them are working so. together. Yeah. Yeah. I'd interpret that as them just being three times stronger. I guess I get why you wouldn't. Um, but I'm not talking about six, by the way. I'm talking when I say you, I mean the viewer. Uh, why one of you oh, might hello. interpret it that way. <laughs> um, I think that if we throw the like war arc signing and I guess pain fight Jiraiya at Naruto, Naruto probably loses yeah. um, even in the war arc. If it's like triple strength, will of fire, and Tsunade, <laughs> and like Orochimaru, uh, yeah, yeah, like and then Jiraiya just being an ass, like but doing his best. Um, Naruto <laughs> probably. Needs, uh, I'm trying, guys. I'm, I'm trying. <laughs> The shield. <laughs> and then, like, with the three times amp, I mean, it's kind of hard. It's kind of hard to say Naruto to win, man. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah. And so, unless he throws that big Ross and Shuriken, and maybe they can't dodge it, which I could, I could see the argument for, especially if they're in closer range. Mm. I could definitely see the argument for that. I Naruto think Orochimaru would be able to do his, like, snake skin thing, and maybe Tsunade would be able to, like, regenerate through it. Maybe. Mm. But those are both kind of like heads or tails. Jiraiya would get cooked by it. Yeah, Jiraiya, Jiraiya. Oh, dead. poor Jiraiya. You're yeah. trying so hard in this fight. <laughs> you guys just aren't giving him a chance. No matter what, it's war art or pain art or art. You just can't make an art before him. Yeah, I know, right? Like, you would have to be like some weird, like, start of Shippen and Sage Naruto. Then <laughs> Jiraiya would probably win. Yeah, uh, they but Jiraiya could pull out a dub. But yeah, but um, any point where Naruto actually has Sage mode, it doesn't work. I think the most interesting matchup is if, like, you take tuning exams, Orochimaru, uh, Sage Jiraiya from the pain fight, and, like, Tsunade from the pain arc, but, like, with her, Byakugo. And, like, I think, okay, so the best way to set up Tsunade here and, like, try and figure out a vague idea of how strong she is is... To like, to use like a meta argument uh, that goes beyond the text of the series, uh, and talk about how Kishimoto wanted to have Tsunade fight Pain, but um, Shonen Jump pressured him to uh, speed up Sage Naruto's appearance. I think it was in time for Christmas, oh, right, uh, okay. or something like that. Um, there was a deadline he had to meet for Sage Naruto. Oh, that's a shame. Pain, so he had to cut the Tsunade versus Pain fight. But the fact that they were going to fight at all means that Tsunade probably wasn't going to win, right? Yeah. Um, and I imagine that he wouldn't have had her nerfed during the fight. She probably would have still had her Byakugo and stuff. Like, nobody would have wanted to watch ass Tsunade versus yeah, me. No. <laughs> so, uh, I think that, like, it, it also doesn't bode well for her that Kishimoto thought that Pain would fight her and still be in good enough shape to fight Naruto, fight Naruto. Yeah. Yeah. to fight and beat Sage Naruto, yeah, exactly. So, um, Tsunade is probably not as strong in the pain arc as she was uh, in the Madara fight based on that. So, I still think she's probably stronger than Sage Jiraiya, though, um, because pain wasn't going to kill her. 
like he, like he killed yeah. Raya, uh, and she was going to be fighting all the pads, maybe just Tendo, regardless if it was all the pads or just Tendo, it still would have been harder than what Jiraiya dealt with. Um, and so I, I think that like in the pain arc, Tsunade would be vaguely stronger than Jiraiya using this argument, Orochimaru would be equal to him, and then you would just throw them all on a team. At the worst, Tsunade should be comparable to Jiraiya, so it's like... The least charitable you can be to the signing is to say that, like, you throw three Sage Jiraiya's at Naruto, basically, but with, like, really good teamwork and roughly three times as strong. I honestly think that uh, Sage Naruto could probably win that fight, but, like, if Tsunade or Rochimaru are, like, stronger than Jiraiya at all, I think it becomes more difficult for Naruto, but he could maybe probably do it. Yeah. Yeah. I think, like, for the most part, like, the initial battle we started off with, with those versions of the characters, it's a bit up in the air. Like, not yeah. completely inconclusive, but it really, really depends on how you interpret certain scenes and statements. Um, yeah. Which one, which you mentioned earlier, anyway. So, I wouldn't say definitively a winner there. If I had to pick one, I'd probably go with Naruto. And then Naruto would lose to like the stronger versions of the Sani, like the, the War Arc ones. And then yeah. I think War Arc Sage Naruto kind of, almost no matter what, uh, would beat all three of the Sani yeah, like, yeah. pretty easily. Like, he's, yeah. just, he's got the clones there. Um, he's obviously got Kurama if he needs to turn that on. I just think that yeah, at that point, it's kind of just unfair. Um, yeah. The War Arc Sage Naruto is just like a different beast. Yeah, yeah. completely. I mean, I think, I think that's it. Um, if you want to mention anything else, Um, no. Uh, I just want to repeat again that Jiraiya is the most ass. Oh. Yes, Jiraiya is, is the most ass. Oh. Uh, like, the weakest, the weakest. <laughs> yeah. Uh, way weaker than Sage Naruto. He never get up there. Way weaker. <laughs> <laughs> Multiple tiers there. below Sage Naruto. Multiple tiers below oh, Sage Naruto. Oh, Jiraiya, pull him out. I love that like Six like hangs out with um, Seth and Swag and that and he has his other like mates he does collabs with that's cool. That was cool. <laughs> poor uh, <laughs> poor Jeremiah man. <laughs> he tried. That was a fun video. And uh, thank you to my patrons. If you want to have your name at the end of every video I upload, link in the description to the Patreon page. One dollar a month or less helps for the channel. Greatly really appreciate it. Thank you guys very much for that. Thank you all for watching. What do you guys think of that? What do you guys think of this? Click like, subscribe, and leave comments down below. Let me know what I should watch and discuss in future videos. I'll see you guys. All you guys next time.